In this video, I will show you how to create a fillable PDF form. This is an example PDF form, which is an admission form and students have to fill few details in these text fields. There are three text fields at the top and one at the bottom. But at the moment, these text fields are not fillable. If I click here, as you can see that I cannot type in these fields. So the first thing I would like to do is make these text fields fillable. The second thing is I would like to add check boxes underneath these subject names so that student would be able to select one, two or three subjects. And this check box is also a form item. And the next thing I would like to create a drop down list and put it here. That drop down list will have two items, morning shift and evening shift and students will be able to select the shift in which they want admission. So this is what we are going to do. This video has two parts. In the first part, we will make this PDF a fillable form and in the second part, I will also show you how I designed this PDF form using a free tool. I will be using a free PDF editor for making this form fillable. And then I will use Canva graphic design tool to design this form. So let's get started. This form is here at my desktop. So first of all, you type sajda.com in your browser. And this is the free online PDF editor. If I click on these all tools, there is one tool to create fillable PDF online. So I click on this tool, then I click on upload PDF file, then I click on this form and click open. Now the PDF which is not yet a PDF form will open in this window. And these are various tools available, label, whiteout, text fields, text area, radio buttons, check boxes and drop down list. You can add any one of these but I'm going to show you text fields, check boxes and drop down list. So the first is text field. So I click on this. Now I will get this text field attached to my cursor. So I place it anywhere here and then I resize it according to my form. Then again another text field and by default this time it will take the same size text field. I can also click here to duplicate the field and I can place it here. If you want, you can adjust the location. The second thing I want to insert is a checkbox. So I click on checkbox and I insert this checkbox and I duplicate this, insert it here. Again, duplicate and insert it here. Now I also want to insert a drop down list. So I click on this and I place it in this area. Now to see the option, I click on this little arrow and there are three options. I only need two options. So to add these options, I click on this field properties icon. I click on that and then I click in this area. I want to put morning and evening and I want to delete this option. Now I can allow multiple selections but in this case I don't want to do that and now I click on outside and now I have these two options and now there is one more text field and I can resize it and that is it. Now my form is complete. This is now a fillable PDF form but first I have to click on apply changes. It will show me this message for a few seconds maybe one or two seconds and then within few seconds my form is ready. Now I can click on this and I can download this form and I give it a name fillable admission form and I save it on my desktop and now you want to delete this file. So simply click on this delete files and now your file has been deleted from their server. Otherwise, if you don't do that, they will automatically delete files after two hours. Now on this free online PDF editor, you can do three tasks per hour. I think which is more than enough for most of us. And now I close this window and now I click on this fillable admission form. And now this is my form and if I click here, I can type in this area. I can select subjects one, two or three. I can also select from my drop down list and I can fill this form. So this is how you can create a fillable PDF form from any PDF using a free PDF editor. And now we move to the second part of the video where I will show you how to design a form in Canva. And now let us see how you can design this form. Simply type canva.com. Canva is a website where you can design almost anything. 
although i have a pro account but you don't need canva pro account you can create a form by using free canva account so first click create a design and normally for forms we use a4 document but if you click on custom size you can select pixel inches millimeter and centimeters and you can select width and height of your form but i want a4 so i can type a4 and i click a4 document now on the left hand side in this area canva will show you many form templates you can select any of these templates if you want and then you can modify it so you simply click on this and it will be your template you can modify this but i want to create a new form from scratch so i press control z and now the first thing is i want a heading so i click on this text it will show me a lot of fonts but the simplest way is you click on add a heading and then you start typing so if you click here there are a lot of free fonts maybe hundreds of them and some are paid where you can see this crown these are premium fonts so i click on one of these fonts so the font will change and now i just center it click and drag and when this line appears it's centered now i want a subheading so let's say i want name and let me adjust the size it's too large and now i can copy this by clicking in this area and duplicate make two or three duplicates and then i can start typing whatever i want and now to align all these text objects you select all this and click on position and then if i want to align left i click on left align and these will be left align now in order to highlight the text field you type r on your keyboard and it will create this rectangle now you can resize this rectangle whatever size you want just like that and now this color is very dark normally in forms you have a very light color even this one is okay something like this now you can duplicate couple of times and you can put it there you can align these very easily now here i want to put some subjects so i duplicate any of the text fields maybe three times and i add three and i will be adding check boxes in front of these later that i will show you in a minute to underline this i can click on that and i can click underline and let's put a date as well and also add a small rectangle here so let's move this a little bit up and now let's put some background on this form so i click in this area and then in this background on the left and there are many backgrounds available so i selected this light color it doesn't matter because they will be submitting this form as a pdf file via email or some other online medium so they don't have to print this form they will simply type inside all the information and it would be good if they flatten the pdf and send it back to you i have explained this how to flatten a pdf in another video you can give them some instructions how to flatten the pdf because if they flatten this pdf this pdf will become something like an image and nobody will be able to change this information which they have typed i will be putting a drop down list here and i will be putting some check boxes here to do that first i have to download this form so i click on share download you can select either of these pdf so let's select this high quality pdf so i click download and now this is your form.